What's up, everybody? It's Blind Run with Blind Run Gaming. We're going to talk about Windows 10 and the automatic updates that are now mandatory and will also be installed automatically as confirmed by Microsoft last week. Hopefully this gets reversed because not only has it been met with a whole bunch of negative and hostile commenters, but we are also starting to already see issues. These issues are directly related to NVIDIA graphics card users. Um, unfortunately, that is going to be me as well. And this is starting to rear its head about four days before they start rolling out the Windows 10 official release. And it's a, it's a pretty big bummer. Not only that, but it also seems to be having issues with multi-screen users, which I am a member of that uh, segment of users as well. And it is because basically the driver is not released through GeForce Experience currently. So maybe when the GeForce Experience updates, this might be corrected. But as of right now, it is not. There is a new Windows 10 driver for the NVIDIA graphics cards. And what is happening is, is as people are installing Windows 10, it is automatically updating all your drivers as well. And it's updating the video card driver. And then it appears that the Enforce, <laughs> Enforce, the GeForce Experience program is saying that you have an outdated driver and then downloading the old driver and rolling you back to the old driver causing issues after which Windows will tell you that you have an old driver and will update to that one. So you get stuck in a driver update automatic update loop that is just a pain in the butt. It is also reported that there are multiple crashes being caused by this driver. Um, I assume that, that kind of goes without saying. And, quote, it looks like driver version 353.54, the latest at the time of this video, is available only via Windows Update. So, that's the only way to get it. I think a workaround could be that you just don't... up you uninstall GeForce Experience or I think you can just turn off automatic driver install anyways. I always have to go in after it notifies me and update it. So that should fix it um, theoretically but I don't think that it's going to fix the multi-monitor issues that are going that are happening right now. The other problem is that the Windows update doesn't even have a driver version number for the NVIDIA GeForce drivers. So you can't see what number that is or see what's going on exactly. But as soon as you try to roll back, it, Windows reinstalls it, so on and so forth. And apparently that driver is the problem with multi-screen users. So damn it. So a word of warning to everybody out there, all the NVIDIA peeps. It looks like you're going to want to hold off on the Windows 10 update until this issue is resolved. There are four days left for this to be resolved and I'm sure NVIDIA will also be trying to work with Windows to get this resolved as quickly as possible. The only other issue that it seems to have is with SLI which are the dual card configurations and PC booting in which Windows will push into emergency recovery mode. So those are all the issues going on currently with Windows 10. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and we will talk to you guys next time.